Hi there, my name is Simon Ashmore. I'm a resident just on the outskirts of the Yorkshire Dales National Park. My thoughts in general on the Yorkshire Dales, I think it's just a really nice different area of the country uh, that people uh, should experience really. You've got multi-day national trails that come through the Yorkshire Dales. Uh, you've got short circular walks around villages, plenty to see for everyone. There's more dog owners now who maybe haven't owned dogs before and they see the big wide open spaces and think, okay, this is great for our dogs to just enjoy uh, without realising the consequences that, that they can have. I think there is that big element of responsibility that dog owners need to accept when they walk in the countryside. If you're bringing your dog to the Yorkshire for the first time, remember it's maybe not just your first time, it's also the, your dog's first time in the Dales, and it'll be unfamiliar with its surroundings, with things it might see. One of the special qualities of the Yorkshire Dales National Park is its uh, wildlife, and particularly its ground nesting birds. Species like curlew, lapwing, skylark, they all nest on the ground. And as soon as your dog is allowed to, it will seek out their nests or their young, and that will mean that that nest could fail. One of the main concerns we have with dogs in the Oxdales is with stock, so farm stock. So we have a lot of sheep, but we also have cows with calves. Now there are two different issues there. When you're around sheep, you really should keep your dog under really close control or on the lead ideally. If you come across cows, particularly with calves, you need to be prepared to let your dog go. Cows will see your dog as a threat particularly when they've got young calves with them. So if you, if you feel you're under threat, you need to let your dog go. Your dog will outrun the cows and everything will be fine. As a special area, it's particularly important to clean up after your dog. If dog feces gets into winter feed hay, you know, it'll be eaten through the winter, that can give sheep problems like liver fluke, it can cause them to abort lambs, so you need to be really careful of cleaning up after your dog. It's just the same as anywhere else. Just for you and your dog to have the best experience whilst out in the Dales or any other area of the countryside, I think it's really important that you make sure you've got your dog under control so it doesn't worry livestock, uh, other wildlife or other, other visitors to the area and it'll just make your day a whole lot more enjoyable uh, and you'll have a really good time.